and welcome to GeoGuster. We have the Strangelands crew here with Alzareth. Hello. The Pastafarian. Greetings. And Talkus. Tyrate. Azuntai. Actually here on time. Karate. I, I was here on the time that you said, and I'm stupid. Get an alarm clo- clock, Scrub. I have three alarm clocks. I just forgot to turn them on. <laughs> <laughs> That defeats the purpose of an alarm clock. Yeah, but Pretty I, much. <laughs> but, but Alzareth, you really need to lower your expect, expect, expectation for the Tolkien The Tolkien okay, yeah. needs to live up He's to my right expectations. Yeah. You have expectations? Right. This is the new yes. challenge, so we're going to go new. Everyone, new. I expect him to reach towards the stars so he can reach the moon eventually. New. All right, so let's discuss last week's weekly champion. That would be... Reddit user R90 with 20,543 points. Congratulations, sir. Congrats. Congratulations. You destroyed us all. Congratulations. <laughs> I think that was his first time participating, so he's got a win. He's one for one so far. Nice. But on to this week's challenge. The link will be in the description. Click on it below and play along with us. Or just play along and don't listen to us, if that's your type of thing. And... Post your scores in the subreddit, which would also be linked in the description below. We'd like to see how you did. Or just on our videos, if you want. Yeah, if you just want to comment, that's okay, too. I'm good with comments. I like comments. I love comments. Yeah, comments are nice. I read all comments. It's just I don't always get a chance to reply to all of them right away. So is everybody ready for round one? (laughs) Yes. Ready? Three, two, one, go. New... All right, so here we are. How's it going, guys? And we we um we have crummy crummy uh pictures here. And I think this guy was driving on the right side of the road. So we got corn. So we're we're looking at Middle America. Oh, well, this is good. John Deere. Big horn. Okay. Oh, there's a water tower over there. Let's see if I can get a different angle to get a Jeff. It says Jeff something. But even then, if it's like Jefferson or something like that, I don't know where that's going to be. Uh, Grimmel and Milan? Yeah, this this looks like, looks like Jefferson and I would I would go on a limb and say that Jefferson is is likely one of the most common city names in all of the country. Let's see if there's one over here in Iowa. Jeez, who knows? I need something a little bit better than oh no. Than Jefferson. We have 45 seconds left. Hopefully I can get through this and maybe uh, we'll get some better images. Oh jeez. Go faster. There we go. All right, there were signs that that could have helped. Open Bible Church. Nope, doesn't help. That says town of something. Nope, it does not say town of something. So, Iowa. Oh, man. Well, this is about as good as it gets. Everybody's going to have the same score, too. They're all going to guess Middle America. Here we go. All right, so that uh, that image quality was pretty awful. <laughs> if you, um, yeah, it, but further down the road, it was better. Yeah, it got better, but then it got bad again, and then it got better again. Oh, um, I didn't get to the second better. Uh, well, I saw the water tower that, that said Jefferson on it, so I assume that that's probably the city name of the looking... Oh, nope, that's someone else's guess. Yeah, Let's my see. guess was absolutely terrible. Yours is um, in the How... state, at least. <laughs> oh, so you guys can see my guess? Yeah. All right. Yeah, because you made the challenge. I know, but I closed out GeoGuessr and, and reopened it. So I didn't recognize Iowa's state shape, so I was like, well... Well, I didn't see anything. All I saw was it was America, there was a cornfield, and the city was Jefferson, which I'm sure Jefferson is probably the most common town name in all of America. But um, So yeah, I guessed Iowa and got 4164. What'd you do, Al? I got 1427 because I 
I didn't notice the shape of Iowa. I saw this thing and I was like, which state is shaped like that? Da, 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 and was going through them and just didn't see it like amidst all the lines. So it's like a broken razor blade. Yeah, Iowa's shape is weird and funky. The rest of them are like Oklahoma's iconic, Texas is iconic, Illinois is vertical. It's one of the few ones that are that way. And yeah, but Indiana's vertical, but Iowa has a bump. Do you not love the bump? Indiana still has statehood. <laughs> I Isn't thought true. we took that away from them. <laughs> I thought we gave it to Kentucky because Kentucky is a far superior state. Uh, well, Kentucky also has statehood. My score is going to be interesting on this one because I haven't slept in a day and a half. So, <laughs> and pasta, how'd you do? That's why I'm going to blame. Um, <laughs> so the cornfields and the whole scenery pointed me to the Midwest. So I plucked it down somewhere in Nebraska. Um, I actually saw a trailer where uh, it had Dim One. Or how it's pronounced. Damon. Uh, I don't even know. I have no idea how you pronounce it. Um, on its side, but I didn't know that it was an actual city in the U.S. So, uh, it's the capital yeah, of Iowa, I got. Yeah. You mean 30... Des Moines? Des Moines, yeah. Yeah, Des Moines. Okay, Des Moines. Uh, it was on the side of a trailer, and yeah, but I didn't know where it was. So, uh, thirty-four, seventy-three points. How did you do, Tarkus? Um. So yes, there was a. Go down the street, you see the water tower, St. Jefferson, in the background of that water tower, there is an image of Iowa. So I spent the next minute and 30 seconds scrolling around looking for Jefferson, which I sadly uh, failed to find. But fortunately, I guessed right on the uh, Iowa sign, and that gave me 4,772 points. There you go. Nice. Ready for round two? Ready. Indeed. Indeed. Three, two, one, go. All right, so Talkus is 600 or so in front of us. Galleria, San Francisco. Okay, so let's get a, an initial guess down here. San Fran. Here we go, San Fran. All right, so. Uh, there's a church there. Oh, wait, this is not San Francisco. <laughs> All right. So, San Martin. Where is San Martin? I don't know why I thought San Francisco when these cars are all right in my face. What a moron. Um, alright, this looks like Brazil. I just focused on that San Francisco and beeline to it, didn't I? Alright. I thought that said jail bait. Oh god. It's horrible, guys. Um, so this is probably I don't know where San Martin is but I'm guessing Brazil 50 seconds left um that's not helping either bizarre there's got to be a, a, a website a URL on these come on dot com that does not help Casino, Playtronics. What does that say? I can't tell. I am I am failing pretty hardcore here. That does not look like a Brazilian flag. But I'm sticking with Brazil anyways. goes so well I, I i i took a quick look and it said san francisco right in my face so i plucked it right in san francisco and then i looked around and i'm like this is not san francisco well i did the exact same thing <laughs> i'm like look at these cars how can i Ugh. i didn't even notice the cars at first it was more about the like just buildings didn't look it and then the language didn't look it I was like, I'm confused. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I'm like, well, I saw San Martin. And I'm like, oh, I don't know where San Martin is. I don't even know if, if that's where we're at. Because it was right next to San Francisco. So I just guessed Sao Paulo, Brazil. And I got 615. That's That seems like a very low score for how far I am, you know? Um. Well, remember that Brazil is quite a big country. Yeah, yeah we're 3,000 I... kilometers away. Yeah. How'd you do, Al? About the same as you, I got 693 points. I guess southwest of you. Ah. <laughs> Pasta? 
Uh, well, I guessed in Mexico. Um, I, at first, I thought it was somewhere near Thailand because those car are called Tuk Tuks in Thailand. Uh, at least my parents told me that. So, uh, yeah, but then I guessed Mexico because it said something about Latin America on a street sign. So, 4,600 kilometers away, 240 points. Well, we are filled. How did you do, Tarkus? Tarkus is going to win this week. Um, it looks like they have revamped the point systems to being uh, capped at 5,000 here, which means that my Albuquerque guess last week will never be equal by anyone ever. But um, I, I, I saw the San Francisco sign, and then like I saw, like, I was like, okay, San Francisco. Then like I saw a sign saying, like, Municipalitadidad, Provincia of Ica. And I was like, okay, there's like the, the Ica province. So I was like looking around for, for the Ica province, but I didn't see it. And I looked in uh, Brazil and Mexico for the Ica province. And I, I didn't see it, and then I saw, I saw the word, you know, mun municipal, and I was like, this is going to be a city province, so it's no reason looking for it. But then I went down the road a bit more and came out at a plaza, and um, across from the plaza, there was a, um, a, a, a sign saying Ica, Peru. So I found the city of Ica in Peru, and with four seconds left, I scrolled in, saw the word Plaza de Armas, Realized that I was um, at a plaza at that time, and in a hero moment, clicked uh, that at the last femtosecond, happened to guess the right side of the plaza de Amas, and got 4,999 points. So wow. you couldn't even get a perfect score. Nice. That's ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> he failed his Tulkus. Yeah, hashtag Murphy. <laughs> All right, you guys ready for the next round? Ready. Indeed. I'm ready to wreck y'all. Three, two, one, go. All right. So yeah, Talkus is is going to run away with this. There's no way we're going to catch up with them unless I get a couple spot on and and he fails miserably. What does that say? All right. So that's Spanish or Portuguese. This guy's just riding the ass of the uh, the Google car. Uh oh. 77. All right, let's just go this way then. All right. So this is perhaps, oh, he got passed. All right, let's see if we can see something on the side of this truck. 420. This is not helping at all. Espana. <sighs> All right. So, is this Spain itself? Because I would not. I would not think this is Mexico. I don't think this is Portugal. Um, or Brazil. There's another one of them cars. So, I don't know. Is this like Spain? Spain maybe. That stop sign was in English, wasn't it? Madrid. Okay. So let's get that down. Um, let's see if I can get a, a an actual street sign. Maybe not with 16 seconds. Bartienda. All right, here we go. No! Madrid, E901. All right, let's go outside right there. How about right there? All right, so that was a, an interesting one. I, I I finally caught up, or the truck finally caught up to us and, and passed us, and there was Spanish on the side, but it's like, well, I don't feel that's Brazil. I don't feel like um, that's any Latin uh, country. And I'm like, well, that's not... Portuguese I don't think I don't think it's Portugal so I was looking around in Spain and I finally went down the road far enough to see a road sign for Madrid and I found the road itself the E901 and I got 4791 how'd you do Al? 4125 I didn't recognize too much but then I started seeing Spanish and I was like oh it's European so I clicked it down in Spain I was just I was northern Spain nothing special I Pasta. 
Um, so uh, I got it from the license plate because on the left side it got a f a somewhat blue shimmer, which meant it had to be in the EU. And I just uh, put it somewhere near the Portuguese border and got four thousand one hundred fifty one points. Tarkus, actually, if I was uh, recently enlightened, uh, French Guiana is part of the European Union, so it could have been there. Maybe I don't know, but um, I suppose this had to happen right after I was bragging about winning. Uh, Tolkis guessed the northeast Brazil and got 70 points, yeah. <laughs> nice! Oh no! Yay, a chance to catch up! Yeah. Well, to everyone except for pasta. I don't know. <laughs> that that didn't... I didn't... Brazil never crossed my mind on that. That didn't look like Brazil at all. Yeah, well, this, I was yeah. all over Europe. Well, I... I yeah. <laughs> Those, like, car signs where it has, like, the two cars on it, one going one way and one going the other way, really just scream Europe to me. Well, it was just like the, the ground was like red, and I was like, the ground ain't red in, in Europe. It's, it's red with blood. The blood of pasta! Eh! Blood of Roman armies, Tolkis. Blood of Roman armies. No! All right, you guys ready for the next round? Yes. Ready? Three, two, one, go! New. All right, so I caught up to Tolkis a bit. I'm, I'm a little behind him still, probably by maybe 300 points or so. All right, the all right. This looks like this looks Portuguese. So this is either Portugal or Brazil. Eighty kilometers per hour. What was this sign over here? It's probably the same thing. Portugal or Brazil, I would say. Let's see if I can get myself a street sign somewhere. Portugal, they probably drive. They probably drive on the right side of the road, I think, right? Hmm. This could be Brazil, though. I don't know. This might help. Um, it's Brazil. Okay, so we're in Brazil. Let's, um... Let's, uh... Let's go on the northeast. I think. I don't know. That's a guess. I don't have really anything to base that off of. Only... Only a guess. Alright, what was that sign? Nothing useful. Okay. This... Alright, good. Good job, Google uh, driver. I'd like to get away from that truck. Alright. We need a road sign with a city on it. Not that it we're gonna... It's gonna help us too much unless it's a major city. Because I don't know my Brazilian cities very well. And in 15 seconds, I'm sure I'm not going to find anything of use. Like at all. Come on. And now we're stuck again. Oh well. Here we go. Oh, oh someone made a Portugal dang. guess. Yeah, I did. I was I I was originally guessing Portugal as well, and I'm driving down the road, and you still beat me. I um I saw a truck and I got I got next to it and I, it had a domain on it and it had a dot br. Oh, but you were I, lucky, git. Yep, but I, I couldn't it, I couldn't find where in Brazil and, and like Al said earlier, Brazil's just so darn big. Even though I guess Brazil, I got one thousand two hundred and seven points. How'd you do, Al? Absolutely terrible. I saw a cap and I was like, is that like Australian something or other? I'm not Australian, um African. So, so Yeah. You guess South Africa? Yeah. Thirty four. I think I got the low score, unless you beat nope, me with you didn't. You did you get zero? I did. No, what did you do, I, Pasta? Uh, well, I guess Portugal because I thought the license plates had the blue shimmer again. And um, I saw writing and I thought it was Portuguese, so I guessed so southern Portugal. And I actually found a stone which said BR-158 for the street, which is the street we are on, and tried to find it in Portugal. Well, 31 points I got. Nice. Talkus? Um, so uh, going down the street, you saw a road sign. And on that road sign was written the word Lira. And Lira, as I'm sure you are all very well aware, 
is the name for the currency of Brazil. So I figure this is like a sign. You know, like if you if you like drive too fast, drive recklessly, then you get fined for lots and lots of liras or something like that. Or maybe it wasn't even that. I don't even know. And then I also saw uh, fixers.br truck sign thing. So I wasn't sure if like it sort of it sort of, it didn't really look northern to me, and it didn't really look southern. It looked sort of like in the middle. I don't even know. So I guess the middle of Brazil and got two thousand seven hundred and forty-seven points. Nice, nice. nice. Uh, and actually, also... in Turkey, they also pay with lira. Oh, what? Yeah, you jerk. Why didn't you guess Turkey? <laughs> Wait, <laughs> gobble, oh, oh. gobble. I'm pretty sure that there. Are, I'm pretty sure there's actually more than two countries that use the lira. Yeah. yeah. Um, Italy had the lira with an e at the end before they took the euro, and I don't know what other countries have lira as well. Well, I'm confused. Was was Italy yes, you dominated be. by Portugal? Was was the Ottoman Empire under Portuguese whips? Yes, yes, it was, and some Brazilians. <laughs> oh, oh, oh actually, well. that's within the in, within the south. Oh, okay. I I, I was looking at uh, the the fix of gas. I guess. I think we have one more round, right? Yes. Yes. All right. Three, two, one, go. All right. So Talcus is probably going to win this unless he has a major fail and I have a major win. Noting the the dotted lines here on the on the road, so this is not American. What do we have here? I can't read that; it's too blurry. Okay, so which way do I want to go? Do I want to go that way? That way turns. And that one. There's there's actually buildings here, so let's go this way. It's gonna to be too blurry. I'm gonna guess Sweden to start off. All right. All right, so we got some signs up here. This is a good thing. Okay. Is that Sweden? I, I It's been so long since we've had a drop in, in Scandinavia that I don't remember Vastermo. I don't remember the rules. Okay. Vastermo get a drop right there or Katrine home and Kungzor all right we got 40 seconds so that's a decent amount of time um, okay is that nope that's not it Carlsman Christian stud all right so these are probably not big cities. I don't see, I don't see the Katrine home. Is thirty is thirty seven miles one way. Where's Kungzor? Kungzor. I don't see Kungzor. And what was the other one? Vestermo. I don't see that either. All right. So the uh, the first thing to notice is the. Um, the roads were definitely not American, and if you went down far enough, you saw the street signs, which which pointed towards Sweden. And I actually found one of the the cities on the sign, the the Katrina home. Oh, but, uh, I found that as well. I couldn't find Kungzor or that other one, so I guessed by and I found Katrina home. Yeah, and and I got forty eight ninety three. What'd you do, Al? I don't know. It's. It's got spinny wheel of doom for me. Um, how close are you to um, Gothenburg? I mean, how close is the answer to Gothenburg? Because I guess southeast of that. Um, like if you go over I to... I think about 200 or 300 kilometers away at yeah, least. Um, I went... I, if you go to Gothenburg and then right to Jenko's... Donko's ping, Jönkop, and then go straight down. Jönköping. Yeah, Yen Coping. I'm about halfway between that and the coast, so. Oh, okay. I guess apparently in Leotorp. <laughs> How many points was it? I don't know. It's it's not loading. Oh, oh that's oh. right. Yeah, I'll be able to tell you guys later. I might add it in like over it. How'd uh, you do pasta? Uh, so yeah, as I said, I found Katrina Holm as well, and um. 
found it till uh, till the end, so I plucked it down somewhere and got 49, 49 points. Nice. Talkus? Um, yes, the uh, Tolkohoka. Well, I, I saw a road sign that, like, it was like a, a t- tourney, tourney sign. Like, what we have here is, like, black and white, only this one was uh, yellow and blue, which is the color of the flag of Sweden. So I thought that might be a thing, and the road signs had similarities with, like, the Swedish writings. So I happened to have a, a very lucky guess in, in Sweden, and I just guessed in uh, Vas- Vasteras, because that sounds like Varholta, which is where we were at. And I got four eight five five points. Damn, you had almost as nice. many points as me. Yep. How many kilometers Yay. away were you? I was forty five point one. Oh, I'm I'm thirty three. Fifteen point eight. Nice. All right, so let's uh let's view our summary. I can't. I'm getting an error. Oh. All right, so. Well, that one. Oh, I'm looking at pastas. Pastas is blue. I forget. I get to see pastas. All right. So I got 15,670. And we don't know Al's. We'll just assume he lost. <laughs> Probably, considering my score. And how'd you do pastas? I'm going to check it on another window. Uh, 12,844. And Talkus? 17,443. And it looks like Talkus yep. is our... Talkus won... Temporary. Temporary weekly champion. Yep, yep. You're not even full weekly champion. You're temporary weekly champion. No. All right, so if you guys want to uh, participate, the link will be in the description of the seed. Click on that, play it, post in the comments what your score is, or go over to the Reddit and, and post your thoughts there and participate. We'd like to see how you guys did. See, like, you're, you're saying this on, like, at the end of the video. Which you maybe shouldn't have done. Because, like, at the end of the video. I did it at the beginning, too. Yeah, yeah, but, like, it, it's redundancies. But, but like, I just like to uh, note that this is the uh, the, the new, quote-unquote, new challenge. So you, everyone I needs to think say new. you are gone to new. rambling mode now. New, bye. See you guys next time. Bye. See ya.